Hello everybody, how are you doing? I am Tiasha, this is Hirat, but this is not a travel vlog. This video is going to be a little bit different. So right now I am at Pine Ridge Hotel in Darjeeling and there are a few things that I want to share with you people. So um, I went through the Google reviews that people have written about this hotel and honestly I've come across lots and lots of them where people say that Pine Ridge Hotel is apparently haunted and they can hear uh, weird noises and everything. You can just read the reviews on the screen right here. So um, you might be wondering then why stay here at all. Uh, one reason of course is because we wanted to check it out ourselves. Uh, the second reason is uh, Pine Ridge Hotel in Darjeeling has a very advantageous location. So it's right on the mall road and um, all the important like cafes and shops are all like um, very close to Pine Ridge basically. And the third reason is Pine Ridge Hotel is basically your uh, very old British architecture. And uh, um, I'm sort of a killer for uh, architecture that looks good and is old so that is also another reason why I wanted to stay over here. Now uh, one of the reviews that I would mention separately is that uh, somebody had written that one of the weird things about this place is uh, there's a power cut uh, every single night apparently at one particular time and it happens to be somewhere around 9 p.m. and uh, right before so it's somewhat uh, um, 15 minutes past 9 right now and uh, around uh, 5 to 10 minutes back actually my friends and I were sort of chilling on the, in the lounge and uh, it's raining heavily outside and uh, there was a power cut. Now not sure what to believe or what not to believe so that's why we sort of want to set out and explore the entire building tonight and uh, let's see what we come up with. Here's hoping not something too scary. It's pretty old. I mean, look at the whole furniture. I mean, the Google reviews weren't that false, was it? Uh, let's go there. You know, I, I, saw saw this, I saw this Google review where they were saying that the door was locked and the next day they yes, were I read that too. Ran away. Mm -hmm. I read that what too. Happened? Uh, there, there's this, there was this incident huh. where uh, like, since all, there are three rooms in one set. Okay. So what happens is like uh, all those three rooms are occupied by one part. So, so they decided so let's lock the main door. Yeah. Let's walk there. Yeah. So they decided let's lock. Did you realize that there's a stark difference between this part and that part? Oh my goodness. Yeah, actually, yeah. Yeah. I, would, I, I think I would rather prefer this one. Yeah, I do too. Yeah, I think I think for us. I think for that one. Yeah, I think for that one. Yeah, what happened to the whole thing? Dude, yes. follow so, me. No, don't follow her. She was possessed yesterday, so let's come back. <laughs> okay, so there was this like there was a single party. Good, huh? So they decided. Yeah. Why is two or three's open like this? Right? Okay, let's not find out. What was that thing you were saying about the drivers here? There are a lot of caves that come around, come around, uh, around the hills, you know. Okay. Like, uh, since I've grown up here, there are there are a few stories that I have heard. Huh. Like, uh, for instance, uh, you know, drivers around the hills they yeah. don't really give lift to women once it's uh, dark. Once it's dark. Um, yeah, even that person was saying the same thing. You remember? It's not because it's not because they fear like uh, they I mean, fear anything else. I was telling the same thing. Na, oh, ha, ha, he was like, exactly. Yeah, that driver. He was saying the same thing. So, yeah. like, what happens is uh, a lot of incidents have taken place. Where, see, actually, there are huge number of rooms over here. My uh, God. There are a lot of seats. Yeah. And he also he also said something like he, yeah, we have, we do 
stories that surrounds the hills like uh, i've grown up hearing them so uh, if i have to like tell you a few a few are like you know uh, there's a play you know coronation bridge right yeah, yeah, yeah you were talking so, about it the other day. Uh, like one that i have heard around that bridge is uh, um, there was once a driver like there have been many many uh, like there have been many accounts of this it's not like one person only like there have been many accounts like once a driver gave give uh, lift to a woman at night uh, basically she was carrying a child so he kind of felt pity so he gave gave, gave her a lift he was on his way to kalimpong yeah. so he gave her a lift and then basically he looks into his rear view like he looks into his rear view mirror and he sees that <laughs> That's what. Oh, water. Ah, water. Yeah. So basically, what he saw was that woman was actually eating that child. That's what? what. Yes, and that's not. I mean, that he wasn't the only one who actually stated this. A couple of drivers did, and a couple of drivers gave that woman a lift. Like mostly new ones, like new drivers who were. Did you hear that? Did you hear about when you were returning yesterday? By yeah, the roads. Not this one exactly, but I'll come to that. No, what do you mean by that woman? Like the woman who's eating a kid? Yes, like she was carrying a child. So any yeah. anyone in the right minds will feel pity. Hey, but anyway, right. these are like folk stories all around. Might be. I don't know. Yeah, boy, I, I mean, I myself, I myself, really, things, I myself haven't really seen a ghost up till now, so I can't really confirm. But that, that's what I've heard. Yeah. You know, so for incidents and stories like this that surround the hills, yeah. drivers, especially uh, around here, are very religious. Whichever, like mostly Nepalis are either Hindus or Buddhists or Christians, and a very few of them Nepal uh, Muslims. Yeah. So whichever religion they belong to, but one thing they are staunch really, they are very strong, staunch religiously. So what happens is, like, they don't really give lift to women, no matter what. Once it turns dark, they are they're just not giving lift to any women, especially the older ones. The newer ones, you know, they don't really know much. Stuff yes, exactly. Kind of but I mean, I don't think it's just like the hills, you know, because this is there. Uh, I mean, in Calcutta as well. Yeah, I mean, wrong. not now because Maybe. bypass has like it's so well lighted yes, up yes, right yes. now. So in women is which is a very so when my dad used to like you know travel at night, he would say that he would always play Hanuman Chalisa, and even he would he and his driver they were very you know they never give lift to a woman even there. Yeah, like I even mean, in Calcutta, just to prob- it's probably a picture of women that men want to paint. I don't know. Probably it's true. I don't. चले दरजा <laughs> 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 So last night was interesting to say the least. Now uh, here's the thing about whether Pine Ridge is actually haunted or not. Well, it's clearly not. 
I mean, firstly because uh, every single time I come to Darjeeling, I personally love staying at Pine Ridge, and this is probably like my second or third time. That is one thing. The other thing, as you've already heard um, a while back, the man who takes care of Pine Ridge, as he said, that uh, people just get scared, number one, because you know it's a huge property, uh, you have such big antique pieces, and uh, given that the building is like unbelievably huge, so a small sound that you make in one corner of the building sort of gets amplified and can be heard from the other corners of the building. And that could be one of the things uh, where people say that they can hear weird sounds. I mean, uh, if you pay a bit of attention, then you can hear it too, but most, more often than not, it's just somebody just closing the doors or opening it or just walking around or just something as simple as putting down a bottle of water on a table. And, uh, you know, like, uh, the man already mentioned that there was, uh, there was this man who was staying on the ground in one of the rooms uh, that's on the ground floor and he got so scared he came down uh, to the reception saying that uh, my TV channel is just getting changed on its own. Well, it turns out uh, he, there was this room facing his room and both of their doors were open. So what would happen is that since the TV sets in both the rooms were exactly the same so if you would change the channel of the tv in one room if the door if the doors were open the channel would get changed in the other room too so you know nothing haunted there and then the things about where doors getting locked and not opening i mean come on it's it's an old property yeah it's supposed to happen all you literally have to do is just push down a bit harder that's literally it um so they're just rumors and uh, I mean, I'm not saying, I'm not invalidating uh, the emotions where people felt scared, but here's the thing. I mean, if you already have that uh, presumption in your mind that my God, uh, it's so old, it's so big, and there's not many people staying, um, you're bound to, you know, just always feel like, oh my God, I can feel the presence, or oh my God, I can hear something. Whereas it's absolutely nothing like that right i mean otherwise i wouldn't have like kept coming back here because i mean i absolutely love staying at pine ridge it is such a beautiful property and like i already mentioned it's advantageous location so really famous uh, websites like uh, Tripoto and TripAdvisor have actually listed pine ridge as a haunted hotel and not just that like one of the most haunted hotels in all of India apparently and it's really sad because uh, at least every time I come to Darjeeling I prefer coming during off season so uh, you know there's not many people and I always stay at Pine Ridge and I've literally never ever felt anything weird so I mean I just tell you people if you come to Darjeeling and if you're you know staying here cherish the architecture uh, cherish your stay here and you know have fun and i mean this place has has so much to offer and let's put it out there for once and for all pine ridge is definitely not haunted if it's anything it's beautiful uh excuse me uh, don't go yet don't forget to like and share this video and of course subscribe to here at and if you have actually stayed in a hotel that was uh, so-called haunted and even you did or did not have an experience, don't forget to share that with us too. I'll see you in the next video.